I'm Sesev, and I use musical instruments to play games. There's hours of practice behind those awesome runs. And I hold a lot of world records. My challenge is to speed run Super Mario 64 on my drums. I actually run towards the bottom. <laughs> I fell. All right, so this is where I do all of my drum speed runs. This is the drum set I use, is the TD17KVX. And I play my games on my childhood N64. The way I set up the drums to play games is I found a program that takes MIDI signals and converts them into like a mouse and keyboard setup. The device I am using to connect the drums to my Nintendo 64 is called a TAS TM32. And this is connected to my computer and it's running a custom script that reads MIDI and shoots out N64 controller. I hold a couple of world records. Zelda Ocarina of Time drum percent, Diffie Ganon. Then there's also a couple of Super Mario 64 drum percent records. It's a pretty tight category with, uh, it's a party of one. <laughs> I'm the only person doing it. If I wanted to move Mario up, then I hit Tom 2. And if I wanted to make Mario jump, I use my bass drum pedal. And then this symbol is B, so if I want Mario to punch. And it's a combination of all these inputs that allows me to speed run the game. I started streaming back in May of 2020, and that got the attention of a lot of people, and so I just continued streaming my drum speedrun attempts online since. Did you guys see that Goomba? Oh, perfect RNG. The challenge today is to beat my best time on Super Mario 64 using my drum set. The time I have to beat is 24.36. All right, let's do it. Ready, set, and start. Nice. Solid start. Okay, we missed the trip, the first triple jump, but the backup is very nice. That strat that I just used was actually uh, sent by one of my viewers. So I'm gonna roll really hard this is the only way I can hold diagonally for a long period of time. Nice. Okay, so right now we have 10 stars. We're about 20 seconds behind world record. Definitely time we can save. Now along with good Gaming, I also need to be a good drummer and not hit things accidentally. So I have to make sure that my plane is as clean as possible as well. Okay, we missed that throw, but we have a clean back. Oof. All right, we died. Good thing is that we can easily reset this fight. There you go. Good recovery. <gasps> and so we end up back here. I think that's the second time that's ever happened to me in a run. There you go. There you go. First try. And we're nearing the end of the game. So to beat Bowser, I actually run towards the bomb. <laughs> I fell. So right there, he ran right towards us. We can just grab his tail. There you go. That was a good, good throw. And we're done. 2740. <laughs> Not bad.
2740 is still good. Getting sub 30 is tough, and getting sub 25 is even tougher. Games are an escape. They're a lot of fun, and I, I just I just love playing games I have all my life. Melting these two passions together has been an incredible experience for me. And I like getting world records. <laughs> Thank you so much for playing my game.